Hey guys, what's up? We've got a very very good news. Yeah, you can see right there, wave H5. Finally, I defeated this wave. I was very very surprised. It was my first time and I haven't recorded this because I was playing just on cell phone. It's not rooted so I cannot record on it. Sadly, yeah. But right now, I'm going to try age again. So, my fellow castle clashers, wish me luck. And here we go. Normal spawn, hopefully. Ornithopters won't destroy my every single tower. Ah, that's not the best spawn at the beginning because it's far from Thunder God and Immortep and the proc is the most important from among all of these heroes and right now Immortep smashed all these Ornithopters now Thunder God with Pumpkin Duke with full energy bars that is something what I really really love the most amazing thing in game is just beginning of a new wave in heavy monsters with full energy bars on your heroes that view just makes me happy very very happy and just for heroes with few this funny guys I don't know how these troops are called because I've never used them so I cannot say too much things about them uh, personally I prefer using ornithopters not at all dragons Be why ornithopters? because they have a lot of HP they are targeting towers at first so the most important buildings and that's the most important things because normal troops will just die all the time they will keep dying you will have to wait for revive and that's something that I really don't like because deploying troops takes a lot of time even now after after some updates that decrease time of deploying troops due to army camps level so the higher army camp level is it, the less time you have to wait for deploy okay things are going not so bad Still all my heroes are alive and I have two towers left with some buildings. Again, pumpkin with full energy bar and immortep. This is very funny way because there is absolutely no flying troops. So it's very good for me and for all of you trying to farm. Uh, this here be monsters and we've got pumpkin duke with full energy bar once more that's very very lucky day for me or maybe not spawn from not the best side come on come on come on I know you can do this guys Or maybe you cannot. As you can see, are they even dying? Why my air towers are not shooting? Oh, they are actually. This is version with mm, decreased graphics so there are, there is less animations 
you can set up this right there let's turn on, turn on normal version because it looks much better and there is less bugs and to be honest I don't see uh, too big difference so I almost did it it was very very close but even if my very very big luck with all the time full energy bar from Pumpkin Duke the spawn was from the left from the left top corner and I had absolutely no buildings in this place so maybe this time I will finish this wave once more with some luck because yeah luck is something that you really need in farming this hidden monsters okay here we go once more now we will see some animations just like in just like in normal version of Castle Cash. And two towers will be destroyed. Or maybe not two. But one with almost zero HP. Sometimes buildings like this with almost zero HP are not the best thing. Why? Because it's only good until troops will reach your building and one hit and your building disappear. Yep. This is the thing that you don't want to see. For example, whole army of troops hordes and of course this five heroes coming to your building okay you are attacking them they are not targeting your heroes but once someone hit your building in my case tower then this building just disappear and this was very lucky sadly Pumpkin Duke don't doesn't have a full energy bar but Immortep has so hopefully he will with his sandstorm target ornithopters come on go for ornithopters I need the stupid tower Oh, oh, I've got two towers with almost zero HP. That's not the best thing in age. But maybe this one will be lucky for me. Come on, I believe that this way will be lucky. Come on, pumpkin you just fill your energy bar. Oh no. Ornithopters are killing my pumpkin duke. He's alone. But he can do it. Even if he is not 8 star, he could finish this. Now, two low HP buildings. It's so lucky that I cannot move even my screen. Immortal proc will save the day. Now Thunder God, full energy. Just come on, please, Thunder God, tar target the stupid dragons. 
they have to die. No, that was so lame. He should target stupid, stupid dragons. But instead of dragons, he targeted ninja. And once more I lost. As you can see, it's not worth for me to farm this wave. Why? Because I don't have a Grizzly Reaper. I don't have a Spirit Match. I don't have a QP. Why the skills are very important? Because first thing, they are flying. Second thing, they are range. And the last thing, their skills, Grizzly Reaper is killing multiple targets. Cupid increases energy of all your heroes. And Spirit Merge also targets multiple targets. So we have the last chance. Who cares? I don't need shards. Right now I've got Pumpkin Duke 7 of 9. Now I can just stop playing because this achievement is, is enough for me in this game. It took me so long to collect these shirts, but I did it. And farming for another skill. Oh, I cannot even think about it. And on 99% I'm going to lose this wave. Yeah, I'm sure. 100% even. No chance to win. This is something really annoying. You are trying to achieve something in the game. And others are just doing this without any problems. You're doing your best and you're getting nothing. Second wave, only one tower lost. Mm -mm. Here we go, second tower lost. But there's a so sandstorm. Oh, and someone died. I knew that I'm going to lose this way. wave. So, actually, without mm, five hero, there is absolutely no chance to defeat H5. No chance for me, but of course some other players can defeat this wave. Some of them even with three heroes. I know one guy that is farming the latest mm, here monsters with five heroes and absolutely no walls. Without any walls, he has so high skills at his heroes and really good talents. Okay, Immon Immortep and Thunder got almost with full energy, please go from this side, and nah, that was very very bad spawn. Very bad spawn. And absolutely I was without any chances. So fuck this. I have so high level legendary heroes. Some of them are already 8 star. And I 
saw some guys with 7 star heroes farming age without any problems. So tell me, where is the fight balance in this game? Champion, he's so useless in him monsters. Okay, he's tuning three random newbie targets and inflicts comma for three seconds stun. But who cares? He's not flying. He's not fast, he's just a fat hero, very slow and with low HP. I need some flying heroes like Spirit Match which targets a lot of t uh, targets at once. So. Nothing special in this video, just showing you how I lost 3 waves with full garrison in a row. And that was very very lame. So, do all the stuff what you have to do with videos. I don't want to say everything again, like in every video. Just please don't forget to do it. And see you soon in new videos. Maybe with more luck. Hopefully. Bye.